What's going on? It's Katie here. And if you clicked on this video, I'm sure you're just sick of trying to find workarounds to get your iPhone footage to look normal in Premiere. For some reason, when you import iPhone footage into Premiere, it looks like this rather than the way that you shot it. So I'm going to show you a couple quick solutions on how to fix this so that from now on you can go out and shoot on your iPhone and not worry about the import into Premiere. So let's hop into Premiere Pro and I'll show you how to do it. Select all of the footage that's blown out and then right click. Go to modify interpret footage. Then go to the bottom section labeled color management and select color space override. Now we're going to click the drop down menu and select rec 2020. This one looks the best in my opinion. If it's still a little blown out, you can drop the highlights on the clip. That definitely helps a lot, but sometimes the footage just looks good as is. I'm currently using an iPhone 12, so Rec 2020 definitely does look better on mine. But depending what phone you have, you might want to try Rec 709. For me, it looks pretty desaturated, but again, it could just depend on which phone you're using. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe down below. Also check the link out in the description if you're interested in what equipment I use for my tutorials as well as my shoots. I'll see you next time with another tutorial.